Okay, we're going to learn how to multiply by a one-digit number. We'll start with the basics. What does multiplication mean? If we do 5 times 3, it means 5 groups of 3. 3, 3, 3, 3, 3. Add those all together. 3 plus 3 is 6, plus 3 is 9, plus 3 is... 12 plus 3 is 15. How does that work with multiplication? 5 times 3 is 15. 15 is more than 9. We can't put 15 here. So we have to put a 1 up in the next column and a 5 here. Now, we don't have it, but there's an invisible 0 there in front of the 5. 0 times 3 is 0 plus 1 is 1. Once you can do that, once you understand what's happening there, we can make the numbers bigger. So now instead of just 5 times 3, how about 35 times 3? Now we have three, 35 groups of 3 or 3 groups of 35. 5 plus 5 plus 5 is 15. 3 plus 3 plus 3 is 9, plus 1 is 10. How does that work with multiplication? 5 times 3 is 15. All right, let's see, the 5s, the 1s. 3 times 3 is 9, plus 1 is 10. Well, 10 is more than 9, so we put the 0, and then we have the invisible 0, and we put the 1 in the next column, 0 times 3 is 0, plus 1 is 1. That's what's happening. Once you can do that, it doesn't matter how big that top number becomes. Let's make it 835 times 3. So that's the same as 3 groups of 835. Five plus five plus five is fifteen. Five times three is fifteen. Three plus three plus three is nine. Plus one is ten. Three times three is nine. Plus one is ten. Eight plus eight plus eight is twenty-four. Plus one is 25. 8 times 3 is 24. Plus 1 is 25. I've got the invisible 0. Put the 2. 0 times 3 is 0. Plus 2 is 2. So there you go. That's how you multiply by a one-digit number. And if you want a challenge, try this one on your own. 7,835 times 3. See if you can work that out. Pause the video if you have to, and then you can turn it back on to get the answer. 5 times 3 is 15. 3 times 3 is 9 plus 1 is 10. 8 times 3 is 24 plus 1 is 25. 7 times 3 is 21 plus 2 is 23. There you go. If you can do that, you're well on your way to multiplying with a one-digit number.